like really really nice silk press and my hair was so long and I was the vlog it's gonna be like what are you eating because what's up guys welcome to a new vlog i am so happy to be starting a new vlog well literally i ended the previous vlog just this morning <laughs> anyway so if today is your first time here thank you so much for clicking to watch thank you so much for clicking to watch uh i'm excited because i'm heading down now to go make breakfast if you know, you know, this girl is a foodie. So I just finished washing my hair. You know, today is wash day. I just finished doing all of that. That took me a good two hours. So now I need to rejuvenate. I need to refill myself. You know, I need to go get the fuel in, AKA get breakfast in, okay? So if today is your first time here, thank you so much for stopping by. I hope you do consider subscribing and don't forget to like the video. So my amazing returning viewers and subscribe. <laughs> if you're returning, thank you so much for always coming back. So yeah, let us just it go make breakfast. What's up, peeps? I'm using my friend camera. Pardon, pardon the quality, guys. I just got done. Okay, I am 80% done with a particular video. Then I'm filming. Then I'm editing 
for tomorrow it's a vlog for tomorrow so i want to have lunch oh my goodness i have a headache all of a sudden because i have like i sat put there and refused to go have lunch so now i've done i'm done putting together tips i just need to find music oh this is hunger headache guys hunger headache anyway yeah this is almost gonna look like what i eat in a day like this segment of the vlog is gonna be like what i eat in a day because i'm about to eat lunch guys when i was in nigeria my favorite favorite juice was pineapple was chia zotti so my favorite drink used to be chia zotti juice my favorite juice used to be chia zotti um pineapple and coconut drink juice i love that juice so much so i saw this pineapple and coconut juice as well at the store yesterday when we went was yesterday i didn't know yeah yesterday when we went so i decided to try it so let us taste it mm. it is nice but it's so sweet like it's too sweet i can't even really get the distinct taste of oh pineapple and coconut okay like yeah after I drink in it, I can taste the um, coconut taste. I can I feel the coconut taste. Taste the coconut taste, whatever. Anyway, yeah, but this is not giving chia exotic. No, I think I still prefer chia exotic to this one. What's up, guys? I just got done blow drying my hair. Initially, guys, I wanted to attempt um, doing a silk press. But with the result of this, I'm not even going to bother. I'm just going to put my hair in cornrows. This is what it's looking like. I just did the blue out. And this was as good as I could get it. This place is so puffy. This is the problem I have. Like, it is so puffy. I really don't know what I, what to do. Like, I really wanted a silk press. To the point that I dreamt that I had a silk press. Like, so guys, I was saying that I dreamed that I had a really, really lovely, like really, really nice silk press and my hair was so long and I was even showing my dad and my mom. <laughs> That's so funny. Anyway, this is what I got just for the blowouts. I know that a silk press would just be a waste of time and just injury to my hair for nothing. So that mean, I mean, I, I know, I mean... Going for that to going for that to flat iron will just be a waste of time. So I'm just gonna cornrow my hair and put on wigs as per usual. Because I don't have extension, I don't have plans other than I don't have other plans for this hair actually.
So, my boss comes here, comes in like eight minutes, and I still have things to buy. So, I'm giving myself five minutes to just head into no frills and pick a few things because I have a list, so I'm just gonna pick one or two and jet out. Oh my goodness. <laughs> I made it guys I, I was like just in time i got out of the um grocery store and then caught sight of the bus and i was flagging it down and it was kind enough to wait for me thank god otherwise that would have been another 30 to 36 minutes wait for the next bus what would i do with myself <laughs> so that was why i just went to no frills i only picked bananas i picked her um, what's it called um mangoes at the very last minute and i also picked some plantains this time i didn't get like ripe plantain but hopefully by tomorrow they ripen up but it feels soft i'm gonna wrap it in a dark bag and see if by tomorrow it comes out right because i'm gonna make beans tomorrow I managed to pick I picked um, a collapsible bucket guys for the past one year plus that we've been in Canada we've not had a bucket okay on, except for like when we were moving here and we got like a mopping pail this, this is the first bucket we are getting here <laughs> if anyone had told me that I could leave without having a bucket I would have said that is a huge lie but I got this for when I want to hand wash some things Typically at our former place, I would soak it in the sink, but right now our sink is very much smaller So I just decided to pick this up so if I just collapse it and put it in the laundry room somewhere I already have one and the drawer that I have here. I can fit in another one just by the side And I got these uh, placement mats or liners for the cabinet the trash bag i got extra spoons and first toilet cleaner this one that you put in the tank i got this one too so for the soap dish i got this one so this will go for the second bathroom upstairs and this one will go in our current bathroom i'm going to take out the one that we already have there and put it downstairs so this is the new one i'm gonna carry you guys along when i eventually put these things together but for now i'm just gonna you know keep them somewhere maybe we only we only start using like the beans so i got this one for the second bathroom this one for the downstairs toilets and those were the only things i could manage i managed to pick out from dollarama and the rest i'm gonna just check timu yeah i also need uh you also need a garbage bin for the kitchen but i've not seen one that i like so for now we don't have one for the kitchen like i see some on amazon but they don't come with a lead and the ones that come with lead that like the one that looks like the one we used to have in our former apartment it's too expensive and it's actually too small i mean it's worked for our former space because we just pack once it's full you just tie it up and throw it in the in the chute you don't need to go downstairs but now you need to literally carry your dustbin and go and dispose it of the garbage general garbage bin and that is a lot of stress so you can't be doing that every day right so that's why we need a bigger bin anyway i'm not gonna bore you guys too much I think I want to make buns. <laughs> I was just scrolling through Instagram. I saw someone a buns video. So I think I'm going to do that once I'm clear. I've cleared all of this up. <laughs> 